So you want to get an 800 on your SAT 2 level 2 maths. Well, you certainly can. And here is the biggest tip that you will need. Well, the SAT 2 maths is split into two categories, the level 1 and level 2. And in popular belief, they say that the SAT 1, SAT level 1 is a lot easier than the SAT maths level 2. And that is completely false for two reasons. One of it is because most of the work is, it's, it's almost identical in a way, the difficulty. And secondly, you can lose more marks on your SAT 2 level 2 maths before you not you don't get an 800, get it? So basically, you can lose up to 4 marks and you're still on your 800 in uh, SAT level 2. But on the SAT level 1, you can, if you lose 2 marks, you're on a 790 already. So, you, you won't want that, right? You all, you all, we all want an 800, right? So, the... Uh, it's best for you to do the SAT 2 level 2 maths. It's just a bit of extra further maths that you'd have to learn, but it's it's worth it. And one more thing is that um, the getting an 800 on your SAT 2 level 2 maths isn't actually that amazing because the national percentile for that um, the 800. When the time I did it, it was 81%. That means 20 to 19% of everyone who did the test got an 800. So if you got an 800, you're nothing special. Um, and also, yeah, that's, that's it. So here's the biggest tip. Get a graphics calculator. You have no idea how much you are going to use your graphics calculator in your exam. Every single question can be solved on this calculator, except for like logic questions, which I absolutely hate. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's the biggest tip. The other, well, you can use um, the other uh, uh, calculators, you know, scientific calculators, but do not use a four-function calculator. Boy. Yeah. Uh, and the uh, second biggest tip is pretty much practice, 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 practice. Oh, right, 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 right. Besides that, I see that a lot of uh, people that um, do not come from American curriculum schools are doing this test. But the thing is, you have to learn the American language in terms of maths. Because there are going to be questions where they're going to ask for what we... I, I, I come from a British curriculum, so I call these things roots. In American curriculum, they call it zeros. Really? And um, there are going to be other tests and questions that are going to involve uh, functions like well, the rational roots test. In my curriculum, we have no idea what that is. So basically, do not think that just because you study maths or further maths in your curriculum, you're going to get away with this. No, you have to learn the SAT 2 uh, level 2 maths independently. So yeah, and the other biggest tip is to do it alongside your exams. Somehow, you get the vibe, the feeling of the exam season going, and it keeps you in this mood, which is very important. Okay? Good luck.